the gadget guru, Andy Parr, and you're watching the Vogue.net. Here's what we're going to do today. Today, I'm going to show you how to take a photo from the gallery and to insert it into a thread. Now, since this feature is only available to registered members of the VOG, the first thing I'm going to do is log in. Now, I do have test accounts that I use here on the VOG. I'm going to put in the screen name of Palm Beach Rider, which is a test account here. And then you click Log In. Now, this takes you to your dashboard page. And without going into details on the dashboard, this is your one-stop shop for everything that's right here on the VOG. Now, granted, this page is customizable, so this page might look slightly different from yours. So the first step in uploading a photo from the gallery into a forum thread is to locate the desired image in the gallery. So I'm going to click Gallery. Now, you notice there's a lot of images here. Now, you could scroll through these, you know, for days on end. But to make it easy, you see this right here? View my photos. If you click that, you're going to see only the photos that you've uploaded. So I'm going to scroll down here. Uh, here's one of our favorite pictures, Andy on the big bike. I'm going to double click that. Now, as I scroll down here, check on the right side of the screen. You see this image details? Now, below this, this URL, you copy this. Now, there's a number of ways of doing it. If you're on a Windows computer, you can just highlight it by clicking multiple times, right click and hit copy. Or on a Windows keyboard, all you do is press the control and the letter C button. That's control C at the same time that copies it. On a Macintosh, it's command and C. But anyway, we've now copied the URL. So now we're just going to click on the VOG logo and go back to the front page. And as you scroll down in the hot topics, here's a test post I just put up. Now, of course, you can go through and navigate to find a thread through a variety of ways. You could go through the new post. You can just click forums and go to the forum and navigate to where the thread is. But here, I'm going to open up this test post. Now, what I'm going to do, I want to now add a photo. So I'm going to come down here in the reply box. Remember, I have that link already copied. Okay, now I'm going to come down here. Do you see this box right here? This is the add a photo box. I'm going to click this. You see that HTTP colon slash slash, it's there. Well, you delete that by highlighting in backspace and then press control V to paste it. I mean, of course, you could always just right click on a Windows computer and paste it in. Now I hit submit. Now you see, unlike the other site where you could preview your post, you don't here. Here you see the image, the link and the image. So you know it's there. So you just post a quick reply. And boom, there it is. It's automatically resized. So even if you have a larger image, it's no problem. It's going to fit in there. At least that's what the admin tells me. We'll find out if they're wrong later. Okay, so that's it. I mean, if you got to admit, it's fairly simple. You have just now taken a photo and uploaded it to a form thread. Now, if you want to add multiple photos to the same post, it's easy. Here, I'm going to go back through and I'm going to edit this thread. But you can do this the first go round. It's really pretty easy. After you've put the first link in, you just space down. Let's give it a couple spaces so the images have a little breathing room. Then go back and hit the add a photo button. Okay, and then you just and then you just paste in the new image, hit submit, and then save. Now look what happens. Now you have two photos in the same thread, and yes, you can add more. Again, remember to leave a space or two in between the photos. It just makes it easier on everyone else. For the Vogue.net, I'm the Gadget Guru Andy Parr, and I'll see you on the road and online.